hindi mo ng tao na laging nasa labas ng bahay. At lagi kayong may dalang mga gadgets. Hindi po kung meron kayong cellphone, meron kayong cellphone, meron pa isang cellphone, at meron pa isang cellphone. Ang dami yung dalang cellphone, diba? Or, baka naman kayo hindi po ng tao na talagang mahiling magdala ng gadgets, like mga gaming gadgets, communication gadgets, camera, ang mga ganyan klase. O baka naman vlogger kayo na laging on the go. Kapag lagi kayong may dalang mga ganyan klaseng gadget na nangangailangan ng battery para gumana, sigurado kailangan nyo ng power bank. So, kung kailangan nyo ng power bank, this video is for you. So, stay tuned. Guys, MIDG here para sa isa na namang video and today we're going to make a video and this will be a tech review and uh, before we start this is not a sponsored video and uh, I purchased the item online specifically sa Lazada ililinaw lang natin para sabihin eh I wish how I wish this was a uh, sponsored video but it's not okay so uh, ano ba tong ili-review natin na item so based on sa sa kalokohong introduction ko kanina eh, this is about a power bank uh, specific power bank brand na hindi ko alam kung bago pa si ito eh I'm not quite sure if it's new dahil hindi naman ako gumawa ng matinding research about you know the background of the company but this specific brand eh talaga namang natuwa ako okay, sobra nakakatuwa siya mainly kasi nung ginagamit ko yung item or I mean nung binili ko yung item the seller or the merchant response was very quick. Place with an order after a few hours, a process na siya, ready to ship na siya. And the following day, nakuha ko siya. So, it's really awesome. I mean, the the purchase experience itself is very good. Okay. Uh, also, the quality of the item, I must say, is very nice. It's very good quality. Yung design nung, nung power bank, well, hindi naman tayo dapat nagiging specific when it comes to the design. Pero, the sophistication of the design of the power bank is very awesome. Uh, I actually purchased one to four different power banks from the same vendor. So, the item, the brand of the item is Vegger. V-E-G-E-R. Vegger. So, hindi ko na isa-isahin yung mga uh, klase ng power bank. Because they are all power banks. They, are, they differ in models, size. Uh, ipapakita ko lang sa isa sa yung mga size, yung kung ano yung Some of them are 5,000 milliamp capacity. And the other two is 10,000 milliamp capacity. Yeah. And uh, so, when it comes to the, uh, you know, the functionality, uh, I would say that it's, awesome because yung, yung 5,000 milliamps I was able to charge like almost two charging okay for the 5,000 milliamps I mean that's already good for a 5,000 milliamp uh, uh, capacity power bank given kailangan natin i-consider kung ano yung sinacharge mo na, na, na gadget so kung anong ga, kung gano rin ka laking capacity nung sinacharge niya na battery so in my case, I'm I'm charging a 3,200 milliamp battery ng phone. So I would say that it's really, it's already good, given that it's almost two charging, one full charge and one almost full charge. That's nice already. So ito yon. Ito yung nakapag charge nun, the five. This is the 5,000 milliamp, and this is uh this is very small. It's almost the size of a credit card. Mas malaki lang ito, mas malaki lang ito ng konti kumpara sa credit card and it's very lightweight and as you can see, uh, mayroon siyang lanyard hole. Ayan, ganda. So this, the output is 2000 milliamps for both USB and the input is micro USB. Okay. Uh, you can use pretty much any kind of uh, usual USB charger gamit ito. And I would recommend, pag nag-charge kayo nito, dapat meron kayo yung 
yung mga mga uso na ngayon na fast charging cable, yung data tra- fast data and charging cable. Na meron ng mga mga sophisticated circuits mismo yung cable to make the the uh, electricity or the current run much smoother and faster. Ito yun. So this is like uh, this is very small and uh, the power charge indicator so they are light lighted dots here and uh, it has a switch there okay again bigger so this is one let's just compare the sizes so this one is also this one is 10,000 milliamps there and this is also lightweight I, actually all of them are lightweight kahit yung pinakamalaking power bank lightweight siya kasi maninipis siya hindi, hindi, siya, hindi ito gumagamit ng ng battery na yung usual na power bank na gumagamit ng battery na 18650 size na battery hindi siya ganun. So, uh, I'm not quite sure it might be lithium polymer or lithium ion battery uh, uh, either of the two. Okay. So the 10,000 milliamps can actually charge uh, almost uh, 5 to 6 charges. Uh, I mean the 6 the, the sixth one is not really full charge but you'll still get a charge. I mean your your gadget will still be charged. Hindi lang full charge. Yeah. So that's already good. Okay. And again, it depends on the capacity of the battery you are charging. So this one is also handy and it also has like the dotted charging uh, indicator here and can switch na. So kung gusto niyo ma-check kung gaano yung capacity kung ano yung capacity ng battery nito, just need to click. Yeah, di ilaw siya. So, 4 means full, ba- full charge. Pero, I doubt kasi itong mga ganitong klaseng item, ay yung mga ganitong klaseng power indicator, pa- uh, charge indicator, this is not 100% accurate. It might be like 80% accurate. Kasi, syempre ito, lock, lock lang yun eh. Mas maganda yung mga digital, uh, digital charge indicator. Kasi mas accurate yun. Malalaman talaga makikita mo kung 100% pa siya, 95%, ilang percent na lang battery niya. But this one, ang kagandahan ito, Siyempre, yung mga digital, eh, gumagamit pa rin ng kuryente yung, yung LCD na, di ba? But this one, of course, it does not really use up too much power. So, mas matagal lang konti ang buhay nito. Again, para i-check mo itong uh, capacity nito, itong battery nito, kung ilang pa yung charger, just need to click the button once. And it will automatically shut off. Yeah. But for this, for this one, click it. There, you can see the light. And then, auto-off din siya, pero you can also off, uh, turn this off by clicking two times. Teka na, pati yung ilang. Ayan. So, see? Yun, namatay. Kung one click, kumamatay siya. Okay, for the next one, uh, compare natin siya dito. So, I, I, I've told you about the sophistication of the design, right? So, this one, look at this. It's, it's freaking awesome. I mean, it looks nice yeah, for a power bank. So this one is made of, this one is just pure pla- hard plastic. This one is a combination of hard plastic and rubber. Yung gray part rubber yan. So it's a rubber grip. It's non-slip. Yeah. Okay, then there is a white version ito. Pero hindi ko, hindi ko binili yung white. Kasi obviously, pag binili mo yung white, lumihin, di ba? So, and given na rubber grip siya, syempre mas mabilis makapitan ng dumi yung mga rubber. So I decided to get the violet. Sana lang hindi, I mean the, the gray. Sana lang hindi siya ma yung nababakbak. Yun. So this one is uh, 5000 milliamps. And this is also thin. It's lightweight and uh, you can Pero syempre, when it comes to size, ito yung pinaka the best na dito. Dahil ito yung pinaka magaan, syempre maliit. Eh. Uh, also, this, you know, if you are the type of person na wala nang time mag-charge ng cellphone niya, and uh, aalis ka bigla ng bahay na walang paapaalam sa mag-usya <laughs> and so aalis ka ng bahay, paalam sa nanay-tatay mo na ipunta kami party yan. o anak, mag-charge ka ng battery mo para pwede ka namin i-text na ganyan ganyan baka malobat ka, kawawa ka naman ay, I mean, mag-aalala ka sila okay lang na, meron na akong power bank <laughs> so meron akong power bank lagi so this is like you know, this is ito yung parang chick-chick, ano yan? Uh, girly version eh, girly power bank to eh yung mga pa chicks na klase na power bank kasi talagang very compact, very light pwede mo siya i lang 
ba? Ito siya, ito siya. And uh, lastly, this one. So this is the digital one. Okay, yeah. It also, you can also check it by clicking the uh, the side button there, power button, and there. So pagka yeah, click, and then pag gusto mo siya off, double click. Mamatay, ching, to mawala. Pero pag click mo siya kasing ganyan, tapos inatay mo siya mamatay, yung makikita mo yung out, yung, you know, yung out na nakalagay. Nakalagay dyan kasi out, yan, hindi siya na mamatay. Ibig sabihin, bukas pa yan. So, ready to charge yan. So, para ma-off mo siya, yun, double click mo, para mamamatay siya na totally. Kasi syempre nga, as, as, as I've said, yung screen na yun, yung LCD na yun, gumagamit din yun ng kuryente, nung power bank. So, nadedrain din yung power bank doon. So, mas might as well make sure na nakapatay yung power bank mo. This one is 10,000 milliamps. I was able to charge the same thing, like uh, almost 6 charging. Okay, for this. Yeah, so, i-compare natin siya doon sa mga... I-compare natin siya sa luma akong power bank na Asus ang brand na gumagamit ng 18650 na battery. Yung mga parang common battery na bilog na mahaba. Kita nyo naman yung size. Okay. Kapal. So, ito yun. Sigurado, 18650 yung laman nito. Siguro, ang laman nito, uh, isa, tatlo. Tatlong 18650. So, uh, again guys, hindi ko na patatagal itong video na to because uh, this is just a review about power bank. Uh, again, not sponsored. And, uh, kaya naman ako medyo na-addict sa power bank because I have used for them. Dahil, uh, nag-online uh, English uh, tutor ako. Online English tutor. Yeah, tutor ako. Online English teacher na lang. Pero hindi ako, ano, hindi ako English major. Yung mga, alam yung mga nauso ngayon ng mga home-based online English. Ano, something. Chuba-chuba. Yeah. So, ganun. And, ito kasi mga to, mostly, kaya ako siya binay dahil na uh, tines uh, nakita ko siya na meron siyang uh, kasi ang importante sa akin is yung 2 output na 2 amp okay yung output na 2 amp and uh, ang purpose nun is para mapagana ko yung kasi for example nagtuturo ako nag brown out eh kailangan ko syempre ng internet mawala yung internet po pag nag brown out so meron kang uh, power bank at meron ang step up cable na 12 volts at kaila ang nire-require kasi ng step up cable at 12 volts uh, para doon sa mga eengot-engot dyan na hindi marunong gumamit ng step up cable at 12 volts make sure na isinasaksak nyo yung power bank nyo ay yung step up cable nyo sa 2 amp dahil pag sinaksak nyo sa 1 amp talagang hindi siya gagana mamamatay-matay yun so kailangan siya at least 2 so ito lahat na pagano ko siya actually ginagawa kong tester ng power bank yung modem at saka kung gano'n siya katagal matidrain Mostly, tumatagal siya ng mga 3, 4 hours, 5 hours. Uh, ito, yung gulo ko, ang tinatagal niya, almost 12, almost 12 hours. Na nakasaksak sa, na, that's not even a joke, almost 12 hours siya nakasaksak. So, uh, once again, uh, thank you for your time in watching this video. And kung naging interested kayo sa video, again, this is not sponsored. Nasinare ko lang siya dahil natuwa ako sa mga item na nabili ko. And, you know, pag nabili nyo siya, baka matuwa rin kayo, baka maging kapakipi kayo na bang design nyo itong, itong mag item na to. Specifically, itong mga power bank, di ba? And, uh, yeah, thanks for watching and uh, until next video.